Hey guys, I'm getting ready to do a boost leak test on uh, 7.3 Power Stroke. I thought I'd just show you this little homemade tester that I made. Um, pretty simple, really. Uh, it's just some quarter inch tubing uh, with a port into the side of the tester. I've got a pressure gauge on there so I can read um, what kind of pressure I'm actually putting into the system. Then I've got a quarter inch regulator. Um, this is just a used piece that I picked up someplace. Uh, just air inlet. QD outlet. Um, none of this stuff has nuts or anything on it. If you drill the right size hole, you can just thread that right into the plastic. And this is just uh, three inch PVC. I kind of beveled the end of it here um, and then kind of scuffed the whole thing up with a file just so it's nice and rough. And you want to be able to kind of really crimp down on that and not have it slip because if that thing blows out with 25 pounds of pressure on it, it'll scare the crap out of you. Um, just a uh, cap. Um, and a plug, or a plug and a, I don't know what that is, I'm not a plumber, so, um, yeah, whatever that is, it's a clean out, I think, is what they call it, a clean out cap, and a clean out adapter on a little short piece of 3 inch uh, PVC pipe, so, that is uh, what you need, and um, I'll try to get some video of how it's used, kind of show you what we're doing to uh, try and find some leaks in the intake system of this truck. All right, guys, uh, I'm doing a boost leak test here. I'm going to try and catch this to show you what I'm doing. I'm feeding shop air into the intake right there. I've got this little blue hose connected to a pressure gauge so I can read what I've got. I've got about 25 pounds of boost, essentially, in the intercooler and in the uh, turbo system. So what I do then is take some soapy water. This is just a little bit of dish soap and some water. Spray it around on everything and look for bubbles. And lo and behold, got a crack in that boot uh, between the plenum on the driver's side and the turbo Y pipe. Also, I don't know if you can see them or not, um, kind of tough to see, but both of Both of the turbo plenums are leaking. I've got some little bubbles that are working their way up through there. And I also found one little pinhole leak right down in there. So I did find a few little leaks. Um, probably that crack in the boot is the worst of them. Um, Probably have to look at getting some different boots to put on here. I don't know if I'll take the time to reseal these plenums right now or not. I'll have to sleep on that and think about it a little bit. That's not an easy job. But, um, I could probably do it now. So, it's one of those things that I didn't really bargain for, but probably should be done. So, at any rate, I figured I'd try to get some video of what we've got. Show you uh, how to do a boost leak test. And um, hopefully we can kind of learn from each other. So that's what we got at this point. Thanks for watching.